been muted. Hi, it's Clark Super Squats again. Uh, today I was going to do the uh, chocolate bahoot jalokia agriculture, uh, I mean, frontal agritech. Uh, agri Don't know what that is. But uh, since I got three of them, I think I'll wait to another day. If one goes bad, I still got two other ones. Uh, instead, I decided I'd go with the uh, Bahoot Chalokia Frontal Agritech. The Gator Strain. And the reason why I wanted to go with that is because like with the name like gator strain, they must be ferocious. So I figure I'm gonna do one of these today. Nice pepper. Almost as long as my finger. So see how this one does. These both these types of frontal lager techs came from uh my friend in Mississippi, Mike uh, Rusum. I mean, Russell, excuse me, and uh, mm, pop, pop this steam off so I can, all right, let's see what this thing does to me. A little bit of fruity taste to it. Goes right with the floral of it at the same time. You can distinguish both of them a bit. Heat starting to build. Definitely got a different taste than the uh, than the uh, pure strain uh, boot jalokia. It's even hotter. It's a little. It's a little hotter than the. Uh, uh, pure strain. I guess that's hence the gator strain uh, name to it. Loaded with seeds. Very hot. Heat still building. Mostly up in the roof of the mouth right now. Hit in the back of the throat. That's typical, typical of uh, the boot jalokia. My tongue feels like I stuck it down in some lava. 
that was full of uh, wasp. That was a nice build of heat right there. Didn't take me by surprise. It slowly built. Now it's a good steady throbbing and hurting in the back of my throat. Still got the, I got that florally, fruity flavor still in my mouth. Back of my throat still hurting. Yeah, this is a little bit more ferocious than the uh, full strain uh, Bucciolokia. This is called the uh, Frontal Agritech Gator Strain Bucciolokia. And it's grown by my friend Mike Russell in Mississippi. This one here is, is like eating at least three or four uh, full strain telokias at one time within a minute, I would say. I should know. I did not in a minute for the full strain. But this one right here, if I was to eat these, I'd be lucky. I'd be lucky get five or six. Heat starting to subside now a little. Throbbing in my throat subsiding. My tongue still feels like it's been stung by wasp. If you can go to show you what this pepper looks like again. Heat still, I mean, just slowly going away, but it's still. It's still making a strong presence, even though it's it's slowly going away. It's still letting me know it's trying to hang on. Every time I breathe through my nose, I'm smelling flyers from the uh, florally uh, aspect of the pepper. Now the heat's high for what it was. And that's that was my review on the uh, Funnel Agritech 
gator strength, boot to low kill. Another very, very hot strain of pepper from my friend Mike Russell. I mean, uh, Russell, excuse me. Sorry, Mike. 